Greetings, I am Cross Knights, and this is Shotgun King, Final Checkmate. It's just chess, it's just chess with a slight twist, not a major twist. But yeah, it's a chess-based roguelike. I, it, it was made specifically for me. I don't know how they, that how the developers even knew me, but they, they decided to make a game for me. Uh, no, you see how the screen's like bowing a little bit? That's actually an effect that you can uh, turn up or down, which I think is pretty cool. You can get, so go, you can get like super bowed, but I don't know. I kind of like the half bowed, where it's just like a slight implication of a curved screen. But anyway, it's pretty short, but when you beat it, you can make the game more difficult, up to 20 times more difficult. I'm currently on difficulty five. I think I'm gonna play on two. Yeah, we go to throne mode. Um, but yeah, this is rank one. I'm gonna play on rank one. Uh, it gets harder the more ranks you go. But yeah, two, two's good. If I play it on one, I'll probably just beat it real easily. Even two, I have a higher chance of failure. And then you get to pick your different shotguns. I'm gonna pick my de the default shotgun. It's actually probably the best shotgun. <laughs> the other ones are more situational. Um, but yeah, let's do this. The Black King had been an extravagant and unpleasant ruler. As the years went by, more and more of his subjects were won over by the White King, who offered higher wages, genuinely decent work. And then they took his castle. His knights resigned from his service. Even his wife, the Queen, abandoned him. Before leaving, the last Black Bishop came to the Black King and told him Thou hast been a bad king, yet thy reign is still holy. Thou shalt retain the claim over thine former subjects' souls, and we may yet have course to fear thine wrath. Thus heed my warning, the wrath of a man as godly as might thee be, is ever his undoing. But the black king was abandoned by all, with not a rook left to his name. All he had left was his prized royal shotgun, the shreds of his dignity, and a growing fire of the prophesied wrath. Ever my undoing, was it? Undone! Just what more exactly could I lose? In his dark folly, the king loaded the shotgun and went to meet his final checkmate. So yeah, you only have the king. It's chess where you are only the king, but you have a shotgun, which increases your range of attack considerably. Just like the king in chess, you can only move one space at a time in any direction. Every other piece is able to move like they... Now, do I need to describe chess? Maybe you're not familiar. Just really quickly, naturally, never mind. Screw it. You'll figure it out. It actually shows how pieces can move when you, you scroll over them. So knights are weird. They can move uh, two directions, one space, and then one direction, another one. That's designated by hovering over. You see the red areas? That's where it can move. Um, oh, and so uh, in chess, you land on a space with another piece to capture it. The pawns are different. You see how there's arrows coming out? They move one space forward. In real chess, they can move two spaces on the first move, but not in this without an upgrade. But they attack diagonally. Uh, the king can, again, he's the king. He's like me. He moves in any direction once. The bishops move diagonally. So, you got your shotgun. Now, the farther away it is, the wider your arc is. Um, your damage will appear randomly in this arc. So, if I aim out here, if it turns black, that's too far. Um, you know, there's, my range is, um, three to five. It has to be in there. Uh, and my power is four. So, that's my attack power. So, I'm gonna shoot here. So, you notice I have an attack power of four, but I only did three total damage. That means one of the shots probably landed, like, here. <laughs> but if you get closer, you can uh, probably do more damage, just like a real shotgun. Now, I'm in check right now. Um, so, I can't move here, and I can't stay here, or I would die. If I try to, you notice one of my shields disappeared. Um, that's a thing that protects you from losing instantly. <laughs> So, I just made a mistake. I, I can get out of it. So, if I move here, my shield is back because I'm not in danger and, and it moved me there. Um, so, it, it just, it's very easy to not see a move. If I kept on clicking, one time I'd loot another shield and another time, the game would kill me. I screwed up too many times. But let's see here. Just like in chess, uh, the game ends when you kill the king. And there's 12 floors and then you win. 
Uh, let me re- you can reload your shotgun without moving, but if you move it, it'll also automatically reload. So I'm gonna point blank this guy. Boom, dead. All- if you're right next to them, all four of your shells are going to go into that target. He only took two damage because that was his max HP. In addition, when you kill someone, you retain the right over their soul. So I can click this and become a knight and move this way. And now I'm gonna start blasting the king. Also, you have limited ammo. When it's all used up, it takes a longer time to get it back. Actually, let me show you. Just gonna fire randomly there. So every turn you get another ammo, or every two turns. So I have to start hopping around in order to get more ammo if I run out. Eh. You generally want to end the game before your ammo <laughs> runs out, but that is definitely not always possible. Um, this is one of- oh. So each time you get it, there's two upgrades you get to choose from. But this upgrade is for me, and this upgrade is for them. So I get stronger, they get stronger. So you not only want to pick a power that suits you, you want to make sure that they don't get powerful in a way that's going to screw you. So this will remove two pawns, the weakest one, and add one rook to the enemies. This, however, is like one of the best upgrades in the game. It protects you from death once. Sometimes, often in fact, your game will end because you get into a situation that's literally impossible to get out of. Everywhere you move, you will die. And it is one hit kills in this. If you die, the game is over. You have to start from the beginning. Um, so I'm gonna get Black Mist. That's kind of crazy that I got it first. Uh, this one's quite good. You can move two spaces at a time if there's a knight on the board. But we're gonna get this. And we're gonna have to contend with a rook, who's like the bishop, but moves in a straight line. So you can see his movement there. Now, let's say I was able to kill this pawn here. Um, if I did that, I would automatically lose because... <laughs> I'm really tempted to fate here. He would then be in my way, and it would be his turn, and he would just kill me. So you have to be careful about that. Sometimes you're not in check, and then you kill someone who was blocking someone who could put you in check, and you die. So you also have to look out for that. I die like that frequently. Reload. So he's he's uh, he can only attack straight. So if I go diagonally, he can't get me, and I can blast him from the side. Wow, he has a lot of health. Five health, that's crazy. It's, uh... Eh. Oh, gotta move there, they can attack me. Now, if pawns get to the other side of the board, by the way, they upgrade and turn into another piece. So you generally want to pre prevent that. I'm just hopping around to get some ammo. Face. Face! Alright, what we got next? Um, add a queen to the board. The queen is the most powerful piece in chess. It moves... It has the power of basically a bishop and a rook. It can move in eight directions. Very dangerous. I don't want to add an extra one. Um, so whatever this is... Which, the blade is good. You can kill people without ammo. But I, I'm going to get this almost definitely. Oh, God. So now the rooks will have an insane amount of HP. But that's still better than a queen being on the board. Um, even though I would get an extra soul slot, which is useful. Um... I've never had this before. Move up to three squares in any direction. That's pretty cool. I'd prefer the blade, but that's pretty cool. Alright, so yeah, let's, let's check out this rook. Yeah, that, look at all that HP. Now, if I kill all of the pawns, then it wouldn't have that anymore. I'm gonna actually... Whoop, <laughs> move all the way there. Blast that bishop. I would love to just... Uh, if I can just kill the king, the game ends. Bam. I snuck behind the ranks with my bishop soul. So that floor is over already. All right, we got Caltrop. Slows down white and black backup cards. Black backup cards? I, I didn't even know there were black backup cards, but all right. Um, that's cool. And what is this? Max ammo and king HP plus two. So that's... It would make my enemy stronger. The um, other side on this floor... Always gets a queen. There's no escaping her. You can't escape her. She's everywhere. Um, so yeah, my former wife is on the is on the floor. I think I'm gonna get Caltrops. So speed is how you notice that like all the enemies don't move every single time I move. That's because they're governed by their speed. And also, let me go on the queen. She's powerful. Look how much she can move. So, it's kind of good that she's boxed in behind pawns. I don't necessarily want to destroy those. I should try this. But let me see here. Um, you see that timer thing? It's blinking. That means he's going to move. He needs more moves. To, so, if I go here, there's now two slots here. So, he's going to move next turn. Uh, she's trapped a little bit. All right, I'm in, I'm in check there. We're going to sneaky sneak 
up here. Nope. Uh, the knight goes here and here, so that would have killed me. That's the same for that. So this might not be the best time. Oh, that's not even the thing I wanted to do. I wanted this. Yeah, all right. So, <laughs> boom. Cool. We're going to shotgun you. Shotgun you. All right, I'm in check there. So we're going to move here. Damn it. I'm in, I would love to stay right here and start shooting the king, but I'm in check because this jerk decided to oppress me. So we're going to... Uh, queen. Okay, they're they're gonna they're gonna really press me here. Um, I'm safe here. Kill you because you're about to move. God, he has so much HP. I I'm about to be in serious trouble here. Uh, I'm gonna strategically move here, which would normally be a mistake, but fortunately I have this, so I can get the hell out of here. Now he's probably gonna move there, but I I think I might be able to. This is bad. I think I think I might have just lost. Uh, I can't move here because the king will get me. I can't move here or here because the king will get me. He's threatening every square here. I am now trapped. So this would normally be a loss. Uh, I'm going to take this opportunity to blast the king. It's going to tell me not to because I'm going to take a hit, but... Remember, I have the black mist, and that is the only reason I'm alive right now. And I'm in a good position to, like, finish off the king. So if I didn't get black mist, I would be dead. Now, will it let me... Oh, God. Uh, I might still be screwed. What happens if I kill the king, though? They can't attack me, right? Yeah, because I can't move anywhere, but... Good, all right. The only reason, despite what it was telling me, the king's dead. I can't lose if the enemy king is dead. They lose their will to fight. Um, push all pieces northward. That's pretty cool. Um... Adds two knights after 20... This is basically nothing. Most of the rounds don't last 22 turns. And if I do, I've probably dismantled the army so much that I can snipe the king at that point. So I might get this, but is this good? Eh, I don't care about that. Adds two rooks... Or adds two pawns and two rooks and decreases the... Nah, 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 nah. We're getting this. That is a non-upgrade for your side in most situations. <laughs> Turn 22. Get out of here. All right, but now I have two wands, which I've never had before. You're done. Now, if I can kill all the pawns, the, uh... The, the, the rook will lose its HP. Alright, I, I'm... I hope that pawn doesn't die. It died. Uh... I would normally love to kill this, but how much HP does he have? Alright, I actually... <laughs> I, I tanked through it. Where are you gonna go? Okay, so I'm safe here. Can I... Oh, I should just kill you, because it's your turn. Oh, God, he lived. Well, you can stay there for a sec. Oh, the queen's dead. You're done. You're done. All right, uh, reload. Only one shell, but let's get rid of that bishop. I don't want to stop these. Okay, I, I was I was wrong. The knights are here. I'm going to kill you so he doesn't upgrade. I just need to get that. I, <laughs> you guys go away. Oh, that's not the right one. Uh, unclick. Go away. <laughs> Go northward. Give me a little bit more time. All right, I got two shots. Just trying to avoid the knights here. What? Uh. Bam. Okay, <laughs> move down. Safe from the knight. Bam. Bam. Uh. Whoop. <laughs> Bam. All right. We're blowing them away. So we got firepower plus two. This only is effective if I'm on the edge of the board. Quite good, actually. Um, pawns can now attack down two squares. I, I actually like this. You can sneak around the pawns and they can't do anything because they can only move forward. Uh, but do I want that or the blade? I think I want the blade, but let me see here. Add one knight. Knight can only be hit when moving. That I'm, I'm not doing this. That makes knights incredibly powerful. And with the backup at the end... Seems pretty annoying. Once again, denied my knight blade. The blade, if you're touching an enemy and they have uh, less than the HP that your blade damage is, in this case three, you can just kill them without using ammo. It's very nice, uh, but it looks like I'm getting this because Nightmare is too powerful and annoying. <laughs> All right, so now the strategy is to try to uh, get to the... I shouldn't use that this quickly, right? Let's use the... Uh, the soul here. Uh, e, I don't like that queen there. Alright, we're gonna... Blast. 
blast. Uh, he can hit me now, yeah. I need to move out of there. I don't like the way that they're positioned. This is actually kind of dangerous. But... Blast. Okay, so... Am I trapped? I might be trapped. If I gust them up now, I feel like I lose. Alright, the only reason I'm not trapped is because I got another Night Soul. So we're going to jump over here. Blast your face away. I did full damage there. I gotta remember, if I can get to the edge of the board, I get more power. The queen's blocking that. I, I'm gonna be in the corner. Alright. Uh, I'm trapped, aren't I? I mean, I would be. But goodbye. <laughs> cool. Um, hello. Rude man. Uh, I can move here because... Oh, no, the queen's there. I can move here. Haha. -ha. Boom. B oh, um. Alright, got the king. <laughs> we did it! Alright, so what is this? So this adds, um, objective markers, essentially. So that's cool. Um, if I get one, I get an extra turn, but I don't know, it's not it's not that useful. I, I, I've never gotten all three, either. What is this? Add one firepower. Great upgrade. Uh, adds two bishops after... T wow, so if I if it lasts a turn 22, I'd get two knights and two bishops. My god. Uh, remove one knight and add two bishops. Well, th this is the better upgrade. This is the better penalty. I'm gonna go with the better penalty. Ooh, that's starting, that's starting pretty close to me. Alright, I don't know what an extra turn really gives me here, but... Yeah, I can't hit them, so... <laughs> Now he's gonna he's gonna come over there. I'm gonna move right here. Queen moving up. I might actually get the firepower bonus. I don't know if that's ever happened to me before. Oh, he can hit me there. Uh, and I can't move there, so we gotta move here. Ooh! Don't like that. Oh wait, I can I'm safe here. He's gonna move Oh, he didn't move to threaten me. Interesting. Um Firepower increased. I don't know if I... I really don't know if I've ever gotten this. So we're gonna... Ooh. Uh, threatened. Okay. Um. Wow, I didn't know those came back, because I never got them before. I'm safe here, oddly enough. <laughs> I was hoping to kill all of the... I just did eight points of damage. Are you kidding me? I'm so powerful. Oh my god. All right. Well, I, I could probably assassinate the king if I play my cards right. I'm gonna move here. And we're gonna... I don't know if that really helped me. <laughs> Should probably just try to kill... Yeah, I can... I'm so powerful I can kill the queen. Bam! Yeah, wow. Okay, those pentagram things are better than I thought. I shouldn't have slept on them. I didn't realize how, how big of a deal it was. Because what is that? It's just plus two fire... Yeah, I guess I just have good firepower. It's really cumulative. Eight is insane. That's gonna kill most things. Um, let's see. Possessed. Add one bishop... Add two extra soul slots. Two extra... I've never had that before. Um, Depot, add a rook. And each time I kill a rook, I gain ammo. Let's see. Your bullets have a chance to pass through. And they get... Okay. I've never gotten... I gotta get this. Even if it screws me. That seems crazy. Look at all my soul slots. I can move everywhere. <laughs> all right. Um, well, now that I know how power... I mean, just this, that, that two extra power is probably not always this good. But just since I already have so much power, it ended up being very good. Boom! Uh, I don't want to move there because the pawn will get me. Alright. Oh! Uh, whoop. Bishop blown away. I, I'm getting stuck in the corner. That's not good. Oh, God. Uh, uh, I can move here and... Oh, oh my God, I'm trapped. Damn it all. All right. Uh, um, I don't see where I can move, actually. Hmm. What, what's threatening from... Is the, okay, I'm not threatened from right here, though. Except by him. So I'm just going to kill him and I'm safe. Despite the fact that the shield is going up. I'm not going to be able to kill him in time. I need to get out of here. I'm in a bad situation. So let's jump here. Whoop. Queen's threatening me. Uh, but since the pawns are shooting down, I can just sneak in between here. Oh, God, you jerks. Uh, <laughs> I'm being threatened from both sides here. 
I could gust them up, but then the queen's threatening me. All right. Um, I'm not safe there because the queen. I'm safe here though, for now. What? That hit no one? Oh, that it didn't let me do it because I'm. Oh, for God's sakes, this is ridiculous. I'm gonna be threatened by the queen. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> um, the queen will die if I. Yeah. Get, let's get through the shields. Ugh! No, I don't have eight. I don't have eight attack yet. What am I? And why'd that only do four? Whatever. Kill her, please. <laughs> um, can we kill these damn pawns and get rid of that uh, rook health? That would be nice. Oh my god, back up. All right, ignore everything. Kill the king. That's my only chance. Uh, um, I have a queen soul. I could definitely make a good escape, but I, I am not doing great. Let's do this. All right, I need one more shot. Can I stay safe? Probably not. There's a million pieces everywhere. Amazingly enough, this is a safe spot. For right now and only right now? Yeah, um... This is a safe spot. I'm just angling. I think I'm not threatened. Amazingly enough, not threatened. Die! <laughs> All right. If that didn't do the uh, if that didn't do the damage, that would have been bad, right? <laughs> Took way too much time on that stage. Almost paid for it. I could get a second um, black mist to give me two lives, but my firing range would decrease to one to three, which is terrible. Uh, I'm probably gonna have to, oh my god, add one pawn every, oh, that's not too bad. Yeah, we're doing this. Give me the firepower. Now I'll have seven firepower, that's a lot. All right. Boom. Boom. I'm getting so many extra turns. Boom! Now let's blow you away. Bam! Oh. Okay, well, fine. I'm gonna bank on him dying. Good. <laughs> Reload. Oh, wow. Look at you guys thinking you're clever trapping me insanely. Boom. Bam! Oh, conscripted, uh, <laughs> conscripted pawn. Boom! I have so much attack power, I can just kill you jerks. Oh, except for you. You have, you have even more attack power. <laughs> um. Whee! Boom! Oh, that's right. Um, bat oh, I hate you guys. You guys suck. Oh my god, I died because that that was a situation. I got the guy who was blocking him and then he was able to kill me. Well, there. Whoop. Boom. Oh my god, come on. You know what? The <laughs> I'm starting to regret letting those guys attack forward. It has helped me, but uh, it's also screwed me several times. All right, there we go. Y you see why the black mist is so important, though. Like, it saved me multiple times. I might actually pull this off. This is the only run I'm going to do of this, because I've gotten all the way to the ninth floor. Um, but I, I've, I've made just dumb mistakes to die so many times. Oh my god, there, there, there's so many recruitment things. Remove one knight adds two pawn. No, I don't want to increase pawn speed. That is incredibly dangerous. Whatever this is, I'm getting. So every 15 turns, there's a knight, whatever. Um, less arc, more firepower. Doesn't happen if there's a piece right next to me. That's fine. My firepower is now eight without using satanic rituals, so... We're moving up in the world. Alright. <laughs> oh, by the way, the turns are at the bottom. I'm on turn four right now. In case you were wondering. Boom! Ooh, it's the queen. She thinks she's hot stuff. Uh... Hmm... There's no place I can go without that guy threatening me, I'm sure. I really want to kill the queen. Oh no, I'm I'm in, I'm under threat from both of them. Uh, let's move here. Okay. Got see. I hate you guys. <laughs> um, I'm gonna be trapped in a second, but hopefully I can get out of it. Oh, but I can't with the rook. Yeah. I think I'll be safe here temporarily, but this is not a good situation to be in. Obviously. The queen's down there threatening me now. Damn it. Uh, oh wait, wait a minute. Take this. <laughs> there we go, I just powered through your HP, jerk. Alright, he's there now. 
Um. What? Oh! <laughs> I think I need to get to the king. If I at all can. Queen's over there, huh? That's there, that's there, that's there, that's there. That's there. These extra soul slots are nice. I, I, all right, queen needs to go. Queen should have gone a long time ago, really. And the king's all the way over there. My god, all right. Pawns are just coming. There comes, there comes like all of the guys. Increased my attack power. Good. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this is bad. Um. Oh my god. <laughs> Ah, uh, ah! Uh, stop them from that. Yeah, there, there's so many guys. The king's, the king's, the king's there. All right. Um. Oh my god. And I'm out of ammo. So that's also great. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Thank God. That got hectic, didn't it? <laughs> God, will I actually get to show the ending? I'm hoping there's another ending if you beat it on the highest difficulty, but there might not be. It just should, just it's text like the beginning. Um, let's see. Use this this one's this one could be good. I will now get pawn souls that increase my attack power by two. Um, remove one bishop and add six pawns. Too many pawns. Um, you can't play for six turns or that that one's rough. You lose your si first six turns. <laughs> but blunderbust. All right. Let's see what happens. That might have been a mistake, but you're gonna see this. Mm-hmm. I don't... Yeah, that was only five turns because I'm in check now, but they're, they're able to really control the narrative here. Boom. Oh, I hate you. Boom. Boom. All right, so... Blast you... Last you. That was enough to kill him. The the queen and the yeah they're they're gonna put me in a bad situation here. Hopefully they both move down, and then this is what I was hoping that I can move them all up. Ha! Huh. All right. So if I move here, now I have an attack power of ten. The incredible um power of the the rooks, the incredible health, is less of an issue now. Uh, let's just reload. Now that is a very threatening, but can I kill her? Do I take the risk? Um, I have an attack power of nine. All right. Taking the... Yep. <laughs> Didn't even give me the shield. It's like, yeah, no, she'll die there. She bad my, my uh, range sucks, but... Oh, all right. Uh, really just need to shoot through these pawns here. Get to the king. Uh, both of those knights are threatening me. Uh, that's threatening me over the, yeah, the reinforcement scam. Okay. Cool. Blasted them both away. I'm just so, I, I've never had this much attack power before. This is crazy. Yeah, like, <laughs> two shots to kill the king still. It's good. Um, here. Damn it. Okay. Oh god, I I'm did it. I, I'm to the last level. And it's all thanks to the fact that I have a 10 attack power. So many years worth of new subjects. So much work to make them feel welcome and safe. All reduced to glass shards by one royal fucker with a shotgun. The White King would not indulge this. Not one more floor. Quite literally... Bursting with rage, he loomed out to crush this egotistical maniac. Alright, final stage. They're all moving a ton because of my, uh, what was it called? My analysis paralysis. Um, so he has 24 HP. He still moves like a king, but he takes up more things. He can definitely trap you if you're not careful. Um, we're gonna... Uh, already being threatened. Okay. Ah, uh, get rid of that knight. Honestly, I think I can win by just pumping shells into this guy. Yeah, he just took... He's done. It's not always this easy, but, like... You're done. Sorry. <laughs> I got too much attack power and was able to do 24 points of damage in one turn. 
And so it was that the wrath of the Black King finally carried him to victory. His turn to steal the White King's castle and subjects. They would have to endure his terrible rule once again. Cheer up, he would tell them. At least thou didn't get blown to pieces. As he upheld his shotgun and laughed, undefeated. He had learned nothing. But it wouldn't be too long before a new White King arises, and the whole story starts anew. And that's it. Every time you beat the game, you can make it more difficult. And boy, does it get more difficult. Just two pawns every single turn. That, that really does make a difference. But then you go to a rook. The king has it. That one's not too bad, to be honest. Uh, but a knight, and I can only imagine how terrible it gets after that. Uh, as you go on, you get different shotguns by doing specific requirements. For example, um, the arc of your shotgun is how, like, big that, like, the, uh, like, the crescent circle thing is. It makes your shotgun less, um, accurate. If you get that to a certain level of, a of unaccuracy, like, you'll get this gun, for example. They all have different attack powers. This one is cool because it starts with a blade of two, so if someone has two HP and you're right next to them, you can stab them. And it adds on, if I got, like, that sword I wanted to get, I'd have a blade of five, which means I could kill most people at close range. It's fun. You you saw from what I had, you, you know whether you want the game or not. Um, I've been playing it a bunch, and hopefully I can get to the highest difficulty one day. But, oh boy, just like... Just look how much more threatening. Th this is the first stage. Like, you will get to the point where there are guys, like, all the way up to here. Um... Just, just three rows of guys, and like, it's crazy. But in any case, ugh, resigned. No. Um. In any case, yeah, try it out. So yeah, you may have noticed that I don't have like a regular uh, series except for Shadow of War. I haven't been able to decide what's going to replace It Takes Two. I'm still going to do more It Takes Two, but I we haven't been able to record more. So I I've just been like kicking the can down the road until I either can record more of that or figure out another game. But I, I've been fortunate to find these little indie games in the uh, in the interim that I really enjoy and want to put, like, at least my, my small spotlight on. So, hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Thank you, as always, to my lovely patrons who make this all possible, and I'll see you guys next time. Later. <laughs>